welcome back to my channel make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and obviously hit the notification button if you definitely want to see you know my next video so i'm actually gonna talk about i've got a lot of questions that told to me by on instagram i don't have my ipad right now but i feel like i remember kind of most of the questions that were asked um so what i'm doing i'm gonna be straightening my hair because i'm actually going out so my hair needs to get straightened in you know what i mean so i think the first question was what does fab beauty collection stand for because you know you sometimes have brands that stand for something so fab fab is fabulous so i am fabulous like you know um you are fabulous beauty is beautiful everyone's beautiful in every sort of way shape face all sorts you guys know the jazz um and then collections is just the whole of my collection so obviously it could be you know in my collections there's lashes there's gloss there's scrub lip scrubs there's lip oils and i would be doing facial mists and stuff like that but i probably do that in the summer because that's when it's gonna pop so that is when i'm gonna wow do you know this year was going to fall but um yeah so to be honest um that is what fab beauty collection stands for everyone thinks that the b there's two b's in fab beauty collections that actually only is one unfortunately <laughs> um i did that on purpose um it would be two b's but it just doesn't look right i just took off the b and it looked so perfect without just one b so i just left it like that and yeah so really and truly that is what fab beauty collection stands for and i do have a quote on every box which i'm going to be changing soon actually i'm not but i'm going to be changing the box very soon because i feel like i want something a bit new and different um so the packaging once you open it it says what makes you different makes you beautiful um so that is literally on every box it just makes people feel happy and you know good about themselves and yeah so that's really what it is um i think the ne next question was how i started my journey so i'm going to talk about that so let's go on so my journey so my journey has been hectic it has not been a short road it's not been a corner road it has been a jagged road it has been it has been i'm not gonna lie it has been amazing but it has been hard and i had to do a lot of things by myself um i did get some support during the way from my family you know you, it gets like that sometimes it really does it really gets like that um I'm gonna use this as a scarf. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna use this as it's actually a good design. Do it like that. So I don't know how this looks. Tell <laughs> you the story of my February collections, how it actually started. So it actually started um in 2015. No, tell a lie. 2017. 18 2018 it started in 2018 so i was in university like in my final year because i finished in 2018 i was just with my friend and i was like i really want to start a lash line this is when lashes wasn't popular it was but not everyone not a lot of people done lashes only like individuals but not strips so i was like i really want to start it i want to like because i just love wearing lashes like everywhere i go out i must wear lashes even if it's natural even this if it's like long like this like i will have to wear lashes like it's just it's just it's just a signature like it's just a, like it's like you wearing a scarf this is my signature like wearing it like this is just me everyone knows me as wearing this scarf that's literally like lashes everyone knows me of wearing lashes so i just started it like i just went on with it um the advice I'll give you guys is make sure you plan because planning, 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 planning is so important. Without you planning anything, you'll know nothing. And when you plan, you know exactly when to start. You know your goals. You know how much you want to get. Like, you just know. And you can just, like, you know, plan ahead as well. Plan ahead is good as well. So, 
if you want to start any type of business i would say focus on something focus on one thing first and then grow yourself and continue doing other things as well but i really feel like don't just start lashes because other people are starting lashes i've actually noticed that and when you do that you will see an error because you will then see people doing other lashes and you're like oh, i want to get there i want to get there you're going to be forcing yourself to get there and then you're not going to get there if that makes sense <laughs> i don't know if i'm making any sense but it all takes time i will never say anyone to just force yourself and do it because other people are doing it do it because you love doing it do it because you love what you do you love lashes you love creating stuff you're very creative you're this you're that me i didn't do it because other people are doing it. i just did it because i love wearing lashes why not bring a lash line and also just make it into a beauty line she just done it like that and i want 2k followers i want 2k followers and honestly i'm so proud that i actually got there because it took a while to get to that certain followers and those followers multiplied it didn't only just give me followers it's me buyers as well potential buyers and honestly i can say to myself i'm so happy that i actually accomplished that because that was a goal that was in within my plan to get to 2k by a certain time and it and it happened i just that's what i'm saying like i feel like planning praying is also one thing i can say the top of the list praying and planning first plan was to make sure that my page was clean my second goal was to change my logo because i knew my logo wasn't standing up properly i knew that it wasn't you know when you see a logo like oh my gosh who did that for you that is how i wanted my logo to be like and my first logo was not that and everyone has that logo that it was that that was my first logo like that is when i changed my packaging and my thing i'll actually show you guys my package packaging it's just this one lip gloss that is in this packaging like yeah so this is shade 26 but this is called lush pink so it's literally like this and it's got my um i don't know if you guys can see it logo written as fab beauty collections and then this is my old logo i have three logos so this is the second logo that i done i done it by myself on like um on illustrator adobe illustrator and indesign this is when i designed my logo like this is the second time round. this is my old logo and then obviously it has the pink ribbons that you guys can see but my box is going to change in november so you guys will see it but it's like this hold on okay right now i don't do it neat but it was like tied like this i'll tie it like that and then when a customer opens it they'll just untie it it's just so easy to untie it and it's man magnetic as well so once you open it you'll see your lashes and you'll see a nice message like this it says what makes you different makes you beautiful it's just something good when you open a box you just want to see a message straight away in your face and that's when i said this is good branding yeah it has been amazing but it subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification button for more videos that's that but yes cheers to the weekend